Hey everyone, what's up? It's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to talk about the second installment of the one-on-one -on -one tell all for sister wives and just something that I found incredibly baffling. And it was when Robin said that Cody and Christine are not divorced. Like technically in her head, they're not divorced. Just when I think that Robin cannot get less self-aware, I'm proven wrong. Take a look at the clip. I have always wanted her and Cody's relationship to be strong, always. I wish that she had decided to keep trying. Where are we at with Cody and Christine? Christine says they're divorced. And technically, in my head, they're not, but because their marriage was done by our church officials. And they haven't granted them a divorce, but I don't know. Today, well, I haven't been a member of that church for a long time, mm -hmm. and I left it a long time ago, and I just have no interest in the church. So to me, the ecclesiastical authorities in that church, I don't really care. I think that God's fine if I just want to be happy. I believe it, and I, I'm comfortable with where she's at with it. She doesn't believe it. So she wouldn't go into the afterlife with you because— uh, Well, see, God has a way of sorting things out. My religion says, uh, 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 that's a dogma of their religion. And I'm going, you know what? You don't know the mind of God. A couple things that I just wanted to point out that I just found, I don't know, just thoughts that were going through my head while watching this. So Christine says that she left the church a long time ago. And we have seen the past several years of this, of Sister Wives, religion has not been like the forefront of the series the way it was in the beginning they, we, fans and viewers have noticed that the brown family has moved further and further away from talking about polygamy in like a religious aspect so christine says that she left the church a long time ago and she thinks god just wants her to be happy i agree with christine I don't think God wants Christine to suffer in a loveless marriage. Another thing is Cody himself has been super wishy-washy on polygamy for years. We saw at the beginning of season 15 when he goes out to dinner with Jan with all of the wives, but it was like Janelle who called the dinner to like, hey, you guys, we're, we're not doing this polygamy thing right. Why, why did we choose to live polygamy? Cody says at that dinner that he doesn't want to be an advocate for polygamy anymore because he recognizes the inherent unfairness. So Cody himself, the head of the family, the patriarch, isn't even super into polygamy anymore. And it's totally obvious because him and Robin are living a monogamous marriage. Cody puts everything on Christine, of course, because, you know, the wives can leave, but he can't. He goes, she left. She doesn't believe in the church's teachings anymore. But Cody, what do you believe in? He, he won't come out and even confirm when the host is asking him, you know, like, do you believe that Christine will be with you in the afterlife? And he hems and haws over it. He, he has no solid foundation of what he believes in anymore, it, it would seem. So we have Christine saying that she and Cody are divorced. We have Cody saying that Christine left him, that she doesn't believe in the church's teachings anymore. And I mean, for all intents and purposes, they're, they're not together. But then we have Robin who says, well, technically, they're still married because their their sealing their marriage was performed by church elders and in her head they're technically not divorced robin what the actual fuck cody and christine don't want to be together don't insert yourself into their divorce we've seen that robin gets uh, she like meddles in the other marriages but does nothing to actually try to encourage mending of any of these relationships but she she wants to be in the middle of it and she wants to know everything that's going on but no don't insert yourself into their divorce 
Since they were never legally married, Christine says that she doesn't need someone to tell her if she's married or not. And if she left the church, if she no longer is believing in that doctrine, then there literally is nothing for her to do other than to say, we're divorced. She doesn't have to file any paperwork. She doesn't have to do any of that. So like, <laughs> I just don't get why Robin is like putting herself in the middle of this. And it's like, how selfish are you, Robin, to want these women to stick around and watch you be the only wife that is in a, quote, full fellowship with Cody? Well, they're all miserable. I really, I mean, like, I really, I want like an in-depth one-on-one with Janelle because truly she does not seem unhappy. Um, she says she will always choose her kids over Cody, but her kids are the ones that seem the most combative with Cody. So it's like, I have so many questions for Janelle, but you know, she says their marriage is just fine. Um, and... I, we can only take her at her word for that. But Robin, why do you want these women to stick around and be miserable when Christine says, why would she want to move on to Coyote Pass and watch him have fully functioning relationships? Why would you want that for her? That's sick. That's sick. If Robin is now going to invoke their religion and the principle and what they believe and the tenets of their religion. If Cody gets super pumped about polygamy again and wants to, I guess, advocate for it more, or, you know, if he comes back around to it, it wouldn't be a stretch to assume that Cody would take another wife or take mo more wives. We know that men can sire children well into their golden years. It wouldn't be a stretch of the imagination to, to assume that Cody might find a new Robin. He might find someone maybe 10 years younger than Robin is and have children. We see that he is way more engaged in being a dad when these kids are young. And he has explicitly mentioned that his responsibility is to his minor children. When these children get older, especially the boys, he gives zero shits about them. All in all, and you guys will have to let me know what you think down in the comments, I just thought that this was so ridiculous of Robin to say. Um, she likes to insert herself into these other marriages. We saw when Cody was quarantining at Janelle, she just happened to pop by um to have a conversation with Janelle which even Janelle was like this is really weird because we like never talk to each other so this is it, it it just really baffled me like why do you want these women to stay and be miserable that's just so that's so mean-spirited and cruel anyways you guys let me know what you think down in the comments make sure you like this video subscribe to my channel Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Reality Squad, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. And just a heads up, this week is the Super Bowl. So for some reason, they think that we would rather watch the Super Bowl than this the final part of this tell-all. So we have a week off. They leave us on a cliffhanger. But don't worry, I have more videos coming. We have much more to talk about. Have a good one, you guys.